Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Shokia Vlogger. The last couple of weeks I've been a little tied up in a bunch of things and one of those were, as you have seen in the title, a motorcycle safety course. So the summer is upon us, at least that's what I thought, and then it dipped down to 40s and 30s again. But hopefully we are going to see some uh, sunny days pretty soon and uh, there will be a lot of bikers out on the road you guys will see. It was the best time to go for this motorcycle safety course. I've been riding bike for a while now. I wanted to go on to this to see how these guys are teaching it and share my thoughts and my experiences. Before we move on, just a few things. Uh, this is not an advertising attempt. I'm not using this platform to share the internal information of this writing course or how the organizers uh, conduct these courses and stuff. I have made sure that all the volume behind when they are speaking or training or monitoring everyone, that volume is gone. Um, so you guys have to really go to the course to get to know what these guys are talking about. All these video shots are basically for the newcomers and the folks who are going to take this course. It's an opportunity for them to see what is going to happen. A couple of things that you guys will notice that it is not that hard. I was really happy to see how these uh, trainers were conducting their all uh, practices and training material uh, it was really nice so before i give you more details about the actual course a few thoughts about a uh, new motorcyclist when you get this course it doesn't necessarily mean that you're fully equipped to ride on the highway this is the first thing and foremost that everybody is recommended to pay attention to i talked to a few fellows over there really cool guys really nice people and they all wanted to ride on different kind of motorcycles when they actually get to the, get on the road my suggestion to everyone is to go to a 250cc uh, or max 300 don't go on 800 or 900 or 1000 cc as your first uh, riding attempt or as your first bike because this course is basically a training model for all of you guys what not to do on the road or how to react to basic motorcycle operations once you get on the road the things are completely different in my personal uh, perception or, or experience but first and foremost choose the motorcycle that is appropriate for your size for your weight and then a lighter motorcycle so you can first get a hang of the wind the air uh, the road conditions and bunch of other things that you will see second thing is about the the gear uh, everyone is highly recommended to please get the proper gear before you get on the motorcycle the trainers during this whole process also mentioned about the importance of the gear but i did notice that a few folks had uh, a startup kind of gear you need to invest in it and make sure that it is for your safety and never forget that. Let's get on with the video and then uh, you'll see what kind of uh, practices, what kind of material that these guys are sharing. Welcome to Shogi Vlogger. Thank you. 
All right, guys, welcome back. Thanks so much for taking time to watch this quick video. Again, this is just to give you an idea what to expect when you go for this motorcycle safety course. Uh, you saw there was a, a booklet in there that they went through and they teach you about those. Uh, the practical training that they give you, they're pretty repetitive. They will make sure that you get the idea before they move on to the next one, which is really great. These guys were extremely helpful. Dave and Sebastian are really awesome trainers. Let me tell you that. Uh, they were very helpful from basic understanding i've been riding the bike like i said for a long time but there are things that i learned personally how to operate a motorcycle or how to park it in a proper way where i wouldn't hurt myself or the fellow riders or the traffic again it's pretty simple course i would highly recommend everyone even though you're a motorcyclist you have uh, experience and but you haven't taken this uh, safety course i would highly recommend everyone to go and take it another advantage of this course is if you're a new rider you can get this uh, temporary uh, license from these guys and then you can make an appointment at dmv and then finally add it on as uh, as your driver's license they also give you a card that you have completed the motorcycle safety course which helps you to i guess reduce your insurance policy there were a few things in their goodie bag uh, there was a pen in there there was a a bottle holder was there and then the of course the book was over there um i think there was a gator as well so cool stuff uh cool idea it was pretty quick just two days um one last recommendation that i would give to everyone is to please take it before summer i cannot really imagine how these trainers and the trainees end up taking this course during summer when you're standing on the asphalt the heat is excruciatingly high so those are a few things just make sure you choose the right bike you make sure you get there on time follow the instructions they're pretty repetitive go for them follow them if you're a new biker again uh, make sure you choose the right bike for yourself please make sure your safety is your number one priority and everything comes secondary take care again thank you for watching shokia vlogger